The Phoenix Trotting Park in the West Valley opened to a crowd of more than 12,000 in 1965, gaining a great deal of national press coverage and things were off to a great start. But it was not long before the park's luck changed. After two and a half seasons, the park indefinitely suspended racing due to the remote location, soaring construction costs, and what ended up being low attendance by the end of 66. But now that is all about to change. Team 12's Trisha Hendricks joining us live in Goodyear with more on the future of this now historical site. Trisha, good morning. Good morning, guys. Yeah, the Phoenix Trotting Park sat empty for decades before it was finally demolished in 2017. But then it was rezoned and things are definitely changing out here. As we all know, Goodyear, Buckeye, these are areas that are seeing exponential growth, not just here, but across the nation. So joining us live this morning is Goodyear City Council member Laura Kano. Thanks for having us. Good morning, Trish. Welcome to Goodyear. Thank you. So talk about the land we're standing on right now and what's in store. Well, this land had a rich history, but it was time for a new vision for it. So the owners came to us and said, we want to create something that is new and innovative. And so what they ended up, uh, the proposal was to have a an area that was for mixed use, dis, uh, districted for entertainment or lots of commercial pro, uh, possibilities. And then there is a, a portion of it that is dedicated to light industrial and perhaps internet fulfillment. And that was necessary in order to pay for the greatly needed infrastructure out here. It's been branded as the Innovation Center. Yes, and we have high hopes that, that as time evolves and everything continues to develop out here, that they're going to have very innovative ideas. They're going to attract users, perhaps tech users, perhaps uh, entertainment venues, uh, retailers, and, and we think that this land has great potential. And what's been approved so far? Well, the the land has been rezoned, and so we've we've determined what they can and cannot build, which is the things I covered before. And so it'll be up to them to attract the users that will then develop into the things that they would like to see and that we want to see. And we'll certainly our economic economic development will help them to attract users. And having a building like this, having wide open spaces, the opportunity is definitely well. Uh, in the eyes of beholders. So it'll be interesting to see where things go from here. Thank you so much. And so it's still to be determined with a few other approvals in, uh, in the works uh, when groundbreaking could be. But of course, uh, maybe as soon as this summer, we'll keep you updated as we learn more. For now, we're live in Goodyear. Trisha Hendricks, Today in AZ.